welcome almighty den know some of y'all are struggling getting them badges man i know some of y'all in my career having a tough time getting the shooting badges some of y'all in the park might not be getting enough shots up to get your catch and shoots your wide opens your playmaking badges your finishing badges and today i have a solution for y'all so y'all be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel click the notifications on because the first thing you need to do is come to sunset park once you come to Sunset Park, and it is a quest, it is a quest, so you can go to the quest, go to Sunset Park, you can be able to play on almost essentially rookie difficulty, change your matchup, as you see I'm doing there, to where the 74 overall is guarding you, and you can absolutely take advantage because it's essentially on like a rookie difficulty. Uh, the green level is the easiest, the yellow is medium, and the red is high. If you're a dog out there and you can win on red, which eventually I'll complete them all, um, you can play on the highest difficulty as well. But... This is a repeatable method if you have a tough time getting progress towards any of your badges that you want to do. Whether it's finishing, playmaking, shooting at me. I just like to get my shooting badges because it's easier in here. And like I said, this is a repeatable method. As, as a disclaimer, I don't really think this is a, a glitch. Um, but it is something that you can do and take advantage of if you're struggling or you need some help. Um, I think this is a method. You have to grind it out. You know what I mean? This is something you have to do repeatedly over and over again. Um, but you can repeat it and keep playing the same teams over until you get at least certain levels on your badges if you want to. Now, me personally, I'm just going to show y'all how easy it is. And I'm going to explain to y'all how to do it. But given the past history of 2K and all, I'm not going to actually do the repeating part. I'm just going to explain to y'all what y'all need to do once we get there. You feel me? But I strongly recommend you have a method for whatever badge you're going after. So for me, if you're shooting threes, if you're a guard, the step back is very, very deadly. A right flick down. On your controller, you know what I'm saying, on the right stick. So that and the step back, easy greens. The green window is, is, is very, very large. If you're a, a playmaker, you want to get your passing badges, alley-oops would be good for you. Um, but it's all specific to what you want to get. Now, me personally, me getting Agent 3, um, blow by wide open, those badges so I can shoot in the park even better is going to go a long way for me. Now, I can get my badges in the park as well, but like I said, I know a lot of the times, maybe some games, I don't always get as many shots as I like um, so some of my bash progress goes down but this is a good way to maybe help get to a certain point where eventually you can get some of those floor setter and badges so they never go back down again hopefully I can get some of those as well because if I get those then we'll be extremely deadly and as you can see my blow by badge is triggering my agent 3 is triggering my triple strike is triggering a lot of things are triggered so try to trigger as many badges as you possibly can and to try to get as many moves off so if you're a dribbler if you're a playmaker be, make sure you're dribbling 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 Step back, shoot, fade, do what you got to do. You know what I mean? Do what you got to do to get the badges you want. You know, if you're a mid-range shooter, you be taking mid-range shots. It's very, very simple. And as you can see, I won here. Now, I'm going to pause the game because I got to let y'all know. You, you want to keep repeating it before beating it completely. All you got to do is once the VC pops up, you close the application, a.k.a. you dashboard. You know what I'm saying? Just close the application. I will let y'all know when that part comes up. Um, very clear so y'all don't mess it up or anything but like I said you still can play these games it's like eight of them total so you still get at least eight games against the AI even if you did for some reason uh didn't dashboard it but it's gonna after all this cutscene and stuff you'll see um, when it gets to the VC earn tab after it calculates everything um, that's about when so it's coming up right now after it calculates you can close app right now and once you reload back in you'll be able to repeat these games over and over and over again and then boom you on your way to having your badges, the ones you want to have. But anyways, if you enjoyed the video, make sure that like button, hit that sub button, cut those notifications on. Until next time, Denski out.